AT&T Center with us, a contingent of the ownership, certainly the basketball staff, Steve Kerr and the coaching staff, but we're going to keep this locked in on the players who will bring this organization back to the third straight NBA Finals trip. And I tell you, Golden State Warrior fans know this guy, most famously for Run TMC. He spent 13 years in the organization, five-time All-Star, 2011 Naismith Hall of Fame inductee. Chris Mullen will present the Western Conference Championship trophy. Chris. Draymond, to you and your great teammates, congratulations Thank and good luck in the finals. Thanks a lot. Draymond Green, you want to share that uh, with the rest of the group Absolutely. so I can ask, yeah, ask yeah. you some questions. Draymond, the NBA season is long, but I would certainly think after a season ago when you had the greatest regular season only to have that year end in terrible heartbreak on a last second shot in the NBA Finals, how does this group recover from that and place itself in this position again, Draymond? You know, really just always knowing what the goal is. You know, um, obviously every year you don't win a championship, contrary to popular belief, you know, you want to, but it just doesn't happen that way. Uh, the Cavs were a great team. They we're able to come out on top, but that's not going to stop us from coming back next year. You got a group of guys, a coach and staff, and the entire organization who's committed to each other, who's committed to the process. And we knew, you know, starting back from day one, trying to get back here would be the toughest thing to do. But, you know, we added some great pieces, and, you know, we're back, and it's a great feeling. You have ripped through the playoffs despite the fact that the last 10 were without Steve Kerr, and you always talk about strength in numbers, but how does this group manage? to go through this whole process, a tough Western Conference without your head coach? Well, you know, I think one thing, you know, I've always said is Steve does a great job of empowering people. You know, from the players to his coaching staff, he empowers everyone. So when one guy goes down on the on the basketball court, the next man up, you know, you see the next guy up. It's the same with the coaching staff. Our guy goes down, he's empowered all his coaching staff to keep everything business as usual. And, you know, it's not like uh, the substitute teacher, everyone act a fool. You know, we have the utmost respect for Mike Brown. He stepped in, done an amazing job of coaching this squad. And, you know, we, just, we follow this lead and we're back in the finals. Obviously, you were a talented group before the addition of Kevin Durant, but can you describe what it's been like adding a talent of his level? Uh, I mean, you know, you had a MVP, you know, one of the best players we've ever seen play this game to a team, you know, that won 73 games was shot away. You know, that, that makes a damn good team. You know, and Kevin has shown, you know, his worth to us. You know, in games where we might have lost last year throughout these playoffs, you know, he stepped up huge for us, come up with 38 points, 33 points, and he's been rolling for us, and we're going to need that to continue in the finals, and there's no doubt in my mind it will. Congratulations, Draymond. If I can get Steph. Steph, the tandem of you and Kevin Durant, I know this is a group that prides itself on the defensive end of the floor, and certainly that was impactful. But in this series, the combination of you and Kevin was dynamic. Can you describe what it's like playing alongside of him? Uh, it makes the game fun. Uh, you know, a lot of talent out there. and. The way that we play when we move the ball and everybody gets involved, um, no matter who's finishing it, you know, we're all happy. But uh, just you know, watching him do what he does and myself, you know, the rest of the guys, it's, it's just a fun way to play, and we uh, want to keep that up. Ron Adams described your game through these playoffs, and that's 12 games now, as maybe the best level that you've ever played at. How would you assess where you're at? Well, I'm having fun, enjoying what I do, playing aggressive, playing confident. And, uh, you know, things are flowing, and it's, it's a part of our identity just to get, get that mojo flowing and enjoy what we do every, every night. So, uh, like I said, this is a great checkpoint for us. Uh, we got four more to go, and we got to take it one step at a time. Well, you know because you have a championship to your credit, the heartbreak a season ago. Why do you believe this team is equipped, regardless of who comes out of the East, why is this team equipped to win it all? You said it. We've been through it all, um, and we've had every experience, and we can rely on going into this finals. And um, no matter how you know it, it goes and how the, the rest of this journey happens, I think we're prepared for pretty much anything. And um, it's going to be a fun June first at home in front of our home fans. This group's going to be confident, ready to go. Um, just got to get the job done. Congratulations.